What's up, you guys? Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's Capriciana. Capriciana, it's me. What's up, y'all? So tonight I'm gonna cook dinner for Valentine's because why not? And happy Valentine's Day to you, or happy late Valentine's Day to you, since you'll see this video later. But tonight on the menu, so I'm gonna be making some ribeye steaks with some shrimp, and I'm going to have some mashed potatoes, some sweet peas, and some corn so y'all let's get into it i'm finna sit y'all up and get into it it is a little late my valentine's day been good so far it's been amazing thanks to god and my man period hope it has been the same for you and for not you know you know so yeah here we go got my pan i'm gonna turn it on oh y'all type of stove we gotta stay in so hold on a little raggy had to start up okay so i got that on I'm gonna put some oil in it again. Cheese my steaks right, so let me let me stop. Alright, y'all. So I got my steaks right here. And I'm gonna dip them off with my napkin as I normally do. So I got I'm gonna use some onion powder for seasoning. I got these new steak seasoning I'm gonna try. And my favorite seasoning when it comes to barbecuing. It's my smokehouse maple seasoning. Definitely using it. Adding some minced garlic and I'm putting some butter in a pan as well as this onion, the rest of this onion to enlighten it, okay? So that is the key for this. So while I do that, let me go ahead and um, turn this eye on and get it ready. So again, clicking it. So I'm getting that boy on there, let that little, you know, soak down. While I do that, let me go ahead and start seasoning this meat, y'all. Honestly, I've been ready for some steak. I don't really know why, but I just been wanting some steak. I know, I heard a lot of people be only using salt and, and uh, pepper for their steak. That's why right. this not my cup of tea. Cut this eye down a little bit more. But since I got my steak seasoning on here, y'all. Our garlic powder had used when it was already open. And maple. So this is how we look at this done seasoning. I'm gonna stir it up. Make sure it's all through the steak. I'm gonna take my knife. Pull y'all down so y'all can see it. Take my knife. Oh, 
Okay, y'all, so prepare my string beans with me. I got my pan and um, or my pot, and I'm adding my chicken broth, and I'm adding some Italian seasoning inside, as well as some chicken bouillon, which is amazing for vegetables, for seasoning. I'm adding both of those in my um, pot to get ready to put my string beans in there. And now I'm taking my steak out because it's done. This meal was very quick and easy to prepare. I loved it, um, and it turned out well. So, you know, I decided, you know, we was going to go out. But I was like, no, nah, I want to cook something for you, babe. You know, show my love for you, you know. But this is how it's turning out. And it's going amazing. So now that my shrimp are done after I just buttered them and stove topped them to cook them, I am preparing my corn and I'm going to add me some Italian seasoning in there as well and some black pepper. Just something to just heat it up and spice it up a little bit, give it some extra flavor. And then y'all, my meal will be done. It is completely done. Okay y'all, so this is the finished product. I have my um, mashed potatoes, I have my corn, croissant, sweet peas. Steak and shrimp. So yeah, here it is. 
All right, y'all. So now for to make our plates. So. So now y'all let's get to plating my food. First I'm put these lovely steaks on there and then I'm adding my shrimp. Some on the filter to the side, but it's okay because I'm plating it like that anyways. But y'all, I feel like my steak, I gotta learn how to make my steak a little bit juicier. Um, I feel like it's like easy to cut. It's not dry, but it's not as juicy as I would like it to be. Any tips y'all have, leave it in the comments below. But I'm putting my shrimp on there, add a little extra juice on each steak and you know, get in there. Then I'm going to be going ahead and adding my sides. You know, I have corn, mashed potatoes, and sweet peas, not green beans. My bad, I said that. But, you know. Okay, y'all, so this is the ending product of it. Steak and shrimp, corn, sweet peas, and mashed potatoes. I am gonna try something different. Here's the croissants. I definitely want to learn how to make natural potatoes, red potatoes. I, I, I'm sure it's pretty, really easy, but I've never really made it because I, I just keep buying all this instant stuff and I'm ready for the real authentic food. So other than that, I feel like our dinner turned out to be perfect. This is it. But thank y'all so much for tuning in to my video. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. And let me know if y'all want me to tell y'all more. Um, normally, I'm a little bit more detailed. But this is probably pretty smooth. Anyways, so y'all have a lovely best night. And goodbye. Happy Valentine's.